Zoolander 2 is directed by Ben Stiller and stars Stiller, Owen Wilson, Penelope Cruz and Will Ferrell. It is set several years after the original Zoolander and Derek and Hansel are back. They are reunited and re-enter a fashion and modelling world that has left them behind. They must foil a conspiracy surrounding the Chosen One while also Derek reconnects with his estranged son. Now, the most obvious thing to say about this film is the fact that, honestly, it is no, it's not a patch on the first film. The first film is a bit of a comedy, I wouldn't call it an all-time comedy classic, but it is a really genuinely great comedy. This gets nowhere near the heights of the first film. It just doesn't come close for me. The problem with this film is, this film is consistently very mildly amusing, essentially. The whole way through a film, you'll be basically going, hmm, yeah, and grinning and chuckling occasionally. There is not one big laugh in this film, which is a fairly fundamental problem in a comedy, as far as I'm concerned. There was not one time I was really properly laughing hard or uncontrollably. It is literally mild chuckles the whole way through the film. Possibly not helped by the fact that the, pl the plot in the first film wasn't sensible. The plot in this film is com ludicrous to the point of insanity. I mean, they even remark on this in the film saying this is literally the stupidest thing I've ever heard. And they're not wrong. <laughs> Just put it that they're not wrong at all. I mean, it's a Zoolander film, you're not going here for a sort of, for an enticing plot for something that's going to really keep you on the edge of the street. See, but really? At times it's just like, okay, seriously, what the fuck is even going on anymore? It gets that bad. The cameos, there was always going to be a lot of cameos in this film, and for the most part, they are, a couple fall a bit flat, but for the most part, they are decent. The best one, by a mile, Kiefer Sutherland. He has a recurring cameo in it, and he is great in it. He, he is one of the funniest parts in the film, to be honest, by quite a long way. Even then, it's over the occasional, the occasional chuckle. It's never something that's gonna make you laugh your head off. And that is, unfortunately, what you can say throughout the film. It is not a film that's going to make you laugh your head off, unlike the original film. The original Zoolander had many moments when you would laugh your head off. That, the walk off in the original Zoolander, I absolutely love that scene, it had me laughing my head off. This has nothing that gets even close to that at all. And because of that, it is disappointing. You will chuckle, you will not laugh properly at any point in this film.